ready with me this morning. So I want to tell you about how I met my husband. It's the craziest story you've ever heard. So I had two employees and one of the employees was with her husband in an orthopedic office and he was reading Orange Coast magazine. And he says, oh my God, this looks like a great guy for Dr. Keneally. So she comes back to the office and tells her other co-employee and says, look, what do you think about this guy for Dr. Keneally? So I said, well, let's just contact him and see if he's available. So they called this office and said, oh yeah, he's available. The best way to contact him is email. So this was over 20 years ago. So they contacted him with email. They wrote this big long letter. We work for this lady doctor. She has three kids, et cetera, et cetera. So they sent him the email and then he emailed back sending me a picture. So they sent a picture and crickets, nothing happened. So nine months later, lo and behold, he contacts dear long lost email. I hope it's not too late. So of course my staff is so excited that he contacted me and I said, forget it. It took him nine months, I'm not interested. So finally, after a week, they begged and pleaded with me, just go out one little date. And so I did go out on one little date and uh, we met and we had a very long talk and then he told me he was going on a ski trip. And I said, okay, great, have a wonderful time. He calls me the next morning and he says, you know, I've canceled my ski trip and I wanna be with you. So we spent only one day of the weekend, that weekend together. And then we dated for four weeks and then he proposed to me. And he always has the funniest story, which stay tuned, I'll tell you next time.